Hi, I'm Andrew with Baker's Gas, and we're here today with the all-new OmniShield XC uh, PAPR system. So, OmniShield, they make an OmniShield, and then they make the XC version, which is the PAPR system. Um, got my demo in. We're going to open it in this video. We're going to unbox this thing, open it up, show you what it comes with, the options that this has. This is the flip-up version, so there's two different versions, flip-up and non-flip-up. Um, but this is the flip up version. So let's dive right in. There again, I'll comment on the bag, and they're really nice bags. Um, it comes with a shoulder strap that you can tote that around with. Uh, super nice bag, though. We got our manual. Got our hose there that feeds the system with an FR coating there. We got our Packer filter here. Um, gives you the part number, everything that you need to know, so hang on to that. Comes with two in that system, so two filters, extra there. And we have our battery, and this is the extended life battery. So they make two different style batteries. First, the regular one, and these are lithium ions, so the regular one lasts nine hours. This one lasts 16 hours. So we got the extended life battery in our PAPR system, pretty sweet. And then we have the battery charger there. Once again, they put all the part numbers on there. That's what I love about Lincoln. They, they strap a part number on every piece of box that you get anything with. And then you can reorder if you hang on to everything or write it down. There's our charger. And then here's our clip. Just pull it out. So, why this one's considered the flip up, right? We got the Omni Shield, but then we got shade five right there for cutting. So pretty awesome little addition to that. Um, and that little hood right there, I mean, it's the price difference isn't much, but if you're ever gonna, if you're gonna be cutting or, or doing any sort of thing, I mean, that's a nice addition to have right there. So I believe they make a shade eight as well. Um, so you can get shade eight, shade five. See, and then they also make replacement for all that. And they'll link all this stuff down below. Get this out here. So this is the actual blower motor for the filter compartment, battery, and then we got a little screen right here, on off button, um, and then where we connect our hose and everything. So let me lay this all out here. And then there is a shade eight shield for it. It's right on the bag. So I'll set this off to the side here. Um, pretty awesome looking hood. Um, so the Omni Shield, if you're familiar with the Omni Shield hood, it, it just comes down and then it goes basically like that. It doesn't have all this skirting and everything. So this all comes out um, and it's all Velcroed in there. And you can wash it. It's all washable. It's all FR. Um, and then on the inside there again, all the part numbers for all the pieces that are can, included in this. Uh, got a little buckle out for the back of the head. This is where your hose hooks into. Got your headgear adjustment. We got air that blows, and it blows down from the in front of your face. And remember, it's a positive pressure, so it's blowing air in, sucking it from the back, blowing it in, and then pushing out any particulate that you might be in the area with. So let me get this thing all set up here, and uh, we'll get it. We'll try it out. Uh, let me pop the battery out here. I'm extending life battery. So it's a little bit bigger than the regular life battery, so that it's probably about half the size. Uh, the regular life is compared to this battery. Um, this one is a little bit heavier, but it's not it's not too bad. The whole system is actually pretty light, and you can see it's got a backpack um, shoulder straps too. And like I said before, 16 hour runtime on the extended version. That's pretty awesome. Um, and then you can see how that just all clicks right in there. If I can do it smooth, there we go. And it just pops in line up them little spots and it goes right in and then we'll flip it on here this gives our our battery life and then it tells us what our blower motor is running at so we're at 180 liters a minute that's pretty good um, so what we'll do is I'll just shut it back off and we'll get the hose there we go. so it's Pretty nice. I'll pop this out too just to show you guys how to change that filter. So like all the other competition, you just it just pops open and then this whole cartridge comes out. And like I thought there, there's your little blower motor. But as I recall, so you got your pre-filter, 
um, stuck in there already. We're going to have to take one of them filters out of the box and use it, but we got a pre-filter and then we got a flashback or, or keep calling it a, flash, a flame arrester. And what that's doing is going to take any heavy particulate, so any sparks, big dust, kind of stop it before it hits your pre-filter. And we'll link all these part numbers down below, but those, I, I see a lot of people replace these quite a bit. Um, not necessarily the, the spark arrester, but they do replace the pre-filter and then they replace, obviously, the big filter. So one benefit to this particular setup, um, it's all made in the USA. So it's all quality controlled here in the United States uh, by Lincoln Electric. So everything is made here. Um, all the parts are in availability. I mean, everything's really good on stock-wise, so you can get stuff quickly. And we'll pop this in open. Now, it should just lay right down in there. And then you got the gasket around the edge right there. And we'll pop this back into place. So it just got two little ears. Just line them up. And then we'll, there we go. Can do it smooth. There we go. So we locked it all back in there. Now let me get the tube out here. Now these have been pretty popular. Um, we've been moving quite a few of them. It's just, they're, they're a, uh, even after the pandemic, we thought maybe they'd drop off in, in sales, but no, they haven't. And they've been, people have been buying these and I think a lot of people are using them for, you know, in dusty areas or we've even had people with woodworking, uh, that sort of thing too. They buy them for that, that kind of thing. But a lot of people, that grind, cut, and this one obviously for torch cutting or brazing, that kind of application, and you want to have a uh, papper system, works out perfect. So let me get this all set up and we'll give it a try. All right, so I got the unit on here. See how we got the flip up cutting shield? So we got a shade five, and then we got our nice clear shield, and we got some good peripheral. I mean, I can see about to right about there, but it, it's it's definitely clear. It, it's really nice, and you can see it's just a backpack, so there's no belt. But they turn the motor. You can see they turn that motor sideways, so it comes off and feeds better, so you're not getting hung up with your hose in the back. And here I'll pop it off here now show you something. Got a little chest strap here. Let me flip it all the way off here. Let me show you a couple of things on this. So when they turn that motor sideways, you can now reach from down below and touch, turn that off. And another thing I wanted to show you, you can change 180 liters a minute and we can go up to 210 liters per minute. So that's just the volume of air that's flowing through. And then that little gauge right there is your filter um, gauge. So it tells you when, when that starts to fill up, you know, your filter, it's sucking harder. So it's working that battery a little bit harder. Um, but then to just turn it off, just hold that down and it shuts off. So another thing I wanted to show you guys too on this, and I adjusted this, is it's got a little dampener and you can adjust which way the air flows. So what it's doing is pushing it right down in front of your face. You can either come down straight or you can push it out and kick it out and push it against the front lens. So in the industry this has the highest impact rating on the front lens. Um, they say up to 300 mile an hour impact with uh, particles. So that's, that's pretty darn good. I mean this thing, and it is a very rigid uh, piece of plastic that's um, it's, actually, it's very hard. You, you, if you guys get one, you can feel that. I mean, it, it's hard to bend that, but uh, no, very nice. Anti-fog, anti-static, so it's, it works out well. Turn that air, the air on there, and all that fog goes away, and then you got your cut shield up front. Um, pretty nice hood all in all. I'll tell you what, if you got any questions or comments, please leave them down below, um, and we'll do our best to answer them. But thanks again for watching, and uh, stay tuned for some more.